Ducks communicate with humans and other animals through body language, and one of the most recognizable forms of canine body language is tail wagging. Tail wagging can convey a range of emotions, including excitement, happiness, fear, and aggression. The position, speed, and direction of a duck's tail wag can all provide valuable information about what the duck is feeling. When a dog wags its tail in a relaxed and loose manner with a wide sweep, it typically indicates that the dog is feeling happy and relaxed. On the other hand, if a dog wags its tail stiffly and quickly, with just the tip of the tail moving, it can be a sign that the dog is feeling anxious and unsure. A dog's tail can also be a visual indicator of its mood when interacting with humans or other dogs. For example, when a dog greets a familiar human or dog, it may wag its tail in wide, relaxed manner, indicating that it is friendly and happy to see them. Conversely, if a dog feels threatened or defensive, its tail may be held high and stiff, with only the tip of the tail moving slightly. The position of a dog's tail can also indicate whether it's in the dominant or submissive state. A dog that is feeling confident and dominant may hold its tail high, while a submissive dog may tuck its tail between its legs. The speed of a dog's tail wag can also provide clues about its emotional state. A fast wag typically indicates excitement or happiness, while a slow wag may indicate uncertainty or apprehension. When a dog is feeling fearful or aggressive, it may hold its tail still or even tuck it between its legs. In these cases, it's important to approach the dog cautiously and avoid threatening behaviors such as direct eye contact. It's also important to remember that tail wagging is just one part of a dog's body language. Other clues such as ear position, facial expression and body posture can all provide additional information about the dog's mood and intentions. Understanding canine body language is especially important for dog owners, as it can help them interpret their dog's behavior and respond appropriately. For example, if a dog is wagging its tail and showing other signs of excitement, such as jumping or barking, it may be a good time to play or go for a walk. On the other hand, if a dog's tail is held stiffly and its ear are flattened, it may be a sign that the dog is feeling threatened or anxious, and it may be best to back off and give the dog space. In addition to tail wagging, dogs may use other forms of body language to communicate, such as growling, barking, and licking. It's important to observe a dog's body language in context and take into account the dog's breed, personality and previous experiences when interpreting its behavior. Training and socialization can also help dogs learn to communicate effectively with humans and other dogs.